locale. I just see a bunch of roses around in the western areas. <coughs> Both of them just really playing the projectile game. Uh, going off the platforms and using that to approach. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jose I was going to say, if anyone can make it back from that depth of hell, it would be DVD, but Jose on it. This is going to be tough, man. Yeah, I can't say that I know a lot about this matchup. Um, I know that uh, Adult Link kind of does a, is pretty good against uh, a, a Nest, but I think it's a little more even for Team Link. At least in my experience. Um, and it's funny, it's this really much less aggressive playstyle from Jose. Not that he doesn't, he's always been very good at waiting out his PK fires, but there's definitely another level that he's taking it against DVD. Okay. What kind of combo does he get? Just an F tilt. I love what Jose's doing right now. He's like the wall he's setting up with just two moves. He's back airing, yeah. and then when he resets, he mixes it up with uh, PK fires. This is a great stage for, for Toon Link, but I actually think he needs that top flat if, if Jose is going to go this style. Or he needs to find another way of getting around it. Because there's the other thing is... DVD is sending out all sorts of stuff, and anything that Jose hits is good for him. He's controlling some stages at that activation. Let's see if... I'm curious if that's going to come into play, like if he hits a boomerang or something. Or a bomb. Alright. Bates a ledge jump from tournament winner, and of course, tournament winner really buffed in PM because you can act out of it. But still pretty pretty predictable in terms of waiting out the invincibility, as long as you know when the invincibility ends. Tournament winner, of course, is the jump from the ledge. I know that's like a melee thing. Alright. It's a little bit of percentage, but not a huge opening there for a DVD. Yeah, tournament winner in PM isn't quite as ironic. It actually does win you tournaments yeah. sometimes. <laughs> There's that heavy commitment you were talking about. Yeah, he's willing to do it in neutral. Look at it, he's doing it again. Is that what the meta will become? Everyone plays Ness and just throws PK Thunder battles. Thunder battles. I'm ready. DVD is definitely at a place where a nice confirm will probably kill Ness, but he's DVD. Like a lot of his combo hits start being less of a mix-up. You see how the back air, which would usually combo into stuff, doesn't quite send him, quite send him a little too high. Yeah. I, I was just going to mention, I, I don't know if it's just Jose's great DI or the... Oh, oh my god! Whoa, that was kind of like he power shielded I, right I was going to mention, I don't know if it's, it was Jose's great DI or just the fact that every time DVD seems to get a hit, it's from like such a late part of the hitbox that it just can't confirm it to so the, it's a, it's a very a back air is a very like it's not a there's not a lot of uh, a lot of active frames so it's not that it's more that it just gets a lot of growth and it starts hitting a lot higher up and lower percentage is a sick mix up. Well, no, even at lower percentage you saw it like DVD wasn't really getting crazy combos. Maybe I right. hit here, I hit there. So you got DI out ends the combo sort of. You know? Um, there's something else I want to say. But the nice thing about Jim Link's game plan is he, he's got confirmed for days, right? He's got his boomerang, he's got his bombs, he's got his uh, back air walls, uh, and, you know, he can he can turn a lot of that into KOs. He's going to go for a yep. dare. I was, gonna, I was actually going to say, I feel like it, even a percentage would be in Jose's favor because of what you're talking about right there, the confirms that he has. DVD was kind of at advantage there. He had That's so many different things that could have led to a kill where it looks like Jose's got a fifth for a back air or even a, a double jump up air or some kind of right. grab. Nice setup there, got up up air. I just see Toon Link as a rational character, right? In lower percentages, you want to get use your back air mix-ups to like set up for like up Bs and down airs to get a low percent kill. And if that high percentage is, your grab options against most characters are quite good. You can get a kill. Oh my goodness, Jose. What Jose's are you doing? combos are good at every Jose, percent. what are you oh doing? Oh my gosh. Tower gets him down. He's gonna do it? Yes, he gets it. Super explosive combo. Does a little bit of a twirl off the stage, the peach nair. You know, I'm, I'm very disappointed in the crowd right now. Get behind the Sherbs. I don't know how many people are out there right now, to be honest. I have literally no idea. It could be another dimension out there, and I would have no idea. That's a how dimension far we where are. you could just swap out players. It's, uh, yeah, you could just have Bob go right in there. 
kind of a bop. Could you imagine how many sets I would win if I was able to just put bob Some in Some bobbin? Yeah, that is also part of the PMCC rule. For one stock only, <laughs> Three, you can call two, on one Malachi one, per tournament go. in that stock, and he can take as many as you want, and no, there's no punishment. Alright, back to PS2. Jose already off to a pretty good start. See how dangerous it is at that low percentage and how back it can set up a combo. Even he didn't quite get it. There he does. Forces a jump. And he also got the, yeah, as you say, he also got the jump out of that. I like what DVD did there. He threw the boomerang upwards. I think he was trying to snipe out the thunder. Nice. Or at the very least interrupt, and he's gonna get a close out of the stock right there. DVD playing from from the lead. You know that that did not happen all last game. Oh, he had a little lead. The, the baby lead? Yeah, baby lead in the middle there, which Jose turned around. And Jose putting up his own wall of bears here. <laughs> Back air is just like... Or oh, sorry. The bow is just like... So, so sad looking. <laughs> it really is. It's pathetic. What, what did a child make this? Don't be more strong, man. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> He's definitely listening. He's like, I love you, Adam. I love you, Adam. I'm sorry. You, he set me up. Play Messi. <laughs> it's all Messi's fault. I love the way Jose is able to put like all this pressure from far away with Ness, with thunders and PK fires. Like he's mixing it up on the platform. All right. Gonna go for the F smash, charges yeah. it and gets it. No, absolutely, because you know Jose's making it back. His angles are incredible. What? What's that? <laughs> I told him to be nice to you, Strong Bad. Okay, that's the other thing that I was talking about how, how Chun Link has good uh, out of combo options with his bomb. He can also air dodge into his hook shot. He's very good at getting out of combos. Sorry, right. I'm just watching DVD chef it up right now. He's, he's in the kitchen. He's uh, sauteing those onions right now. <laughs> I like that setup. Drop through the platform with the up air. Wow, Jose felt like he was on that magnifier for a decade. <laughs> yeah, he did. The character uh, is pretty floaty, you know? He's he doesn't... He, he plays like a fastballer, but he's actually pretty bloody, you know? Relatively speaking, of course. DVD, you know, he, he's got to figure something out. He's taking so much damage right now. Jose is creeping his way back into this game. Oh, oh my god! And you greedy, greedy that, man. Oh. If you're a DVD, you gotta be thinking, man, what do I gotta do to close out this stock? First the up B, doesn't get a kill out of it anyway. Then he hits an up B on his end, it doesn't do anything. He's gonna get oh gimped! Oh my god, he got gimped with the PK Thunder. Yeah, Jose had a, the perfect down air to get out of uh, uh, DVD's up B. Looks like, like, one of the things about Toon Link's up B is a lot of the setups don't appear to be, like, guaranteed. You can air dodge or act out of them, but not everyone has an option. And you gotta commit to an air dodge if you wanna get out of it. It took a lot longer than he wanted. Yes, way, way longer than he wanted. And we've seen the stocks from Jose have been a lot scarier in terms of the explosiveness. We haven't seen like a like a straight like zero to death from. Uh, he's not doing it this time. Yeah, he, he knows better. Yeah, we haven't seen a straight zero to death really from DVD. Oh, I don't think that was what he wanted. I think he wanted to. Holy fair. Jose goes for that gimp again, but kind of looks like he maybe messed it up a little bit. Oh no, that's bad for DVD, and he makes it out. That was such a smart play on him. He just faded back, went straight for ledge, ended up getting it, and then gets back on stage as soon as possible. Jose goes for that pivot grab to back throw setup, which would have killed the DVD, and the bomb actually. You, oh my God. Jose is, is, he like, nuts? is he nuts? Is he nuts? He uses that bomb to his advantage. A lot of characters, when they hit with the air to air versus Link or Toon Link, they're in a bad position. But uh, Ness, with all those double jumps, is really able to uh, Three, make make, make two, work of, of Toon Link. One, go! 
<laughs> oh man. Warrior wear. Is, is this a cop out? No. It's actually Toon Link's probably best stage. Yeah, it's often yeah. stated to be um, at least DVD's best stage, if not Toon Link's best stage. Oh, oh what? Oh, no! How, how does this oh, even that was That's most, such a DVD that's moment. That's the most DVD thing ever. <laughs> Just grab, dude. How often do you get free grabs? You're a tether character. He goes for the F smash, but Jose with this crispiest of sweet spots. DVD is willing to go out there with the bombs. He got his jump back. I would opt it again with the forward smash. He, he started the FB from a much higher spot than last time. Can we talk about how the fact Jose is a survivor? He's in these terrible positions against a character that has a lot of options to harass him. It always makes it out and tends to turn around the stock on, on DVD. Yeah, his movement and his option selection is crazy. Like, everything he's doing is just smooth, and it, and some of it's just weird. And you're like, what do I do against that? Yes, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Oh, but he kills himself. That, 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 yeah, unfortunate. Yeah, it's scary with Ness. You gotta commit to that huge... You feel like, you feel a little bit like Puff with the moving rest. Like you're sleeping for a little bit and they can punish it, and the rest keeps going, but... Oh, you're really my, gonna, oh goodness. my god, DVD is crazy. Still... Boomerang caught it. Boomerang caught really? it, yeah. Nice, nice. That's something that is like, I love to see. That was high IQ. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's one thing that you can do against Nash, which is really solid, is just just throw stuff at his uh, his PK Thunder. Wow, he read the jump so hard with that down air. And DVD is showing you why this is his favorite stage. Yeah, if you're Jose, you need to close this out this game because you know what? That last game was really close. DVD's starting to figure out some things right now. You don't want it to go longer than game three. You know, you're already down a stock. DVD's figuring it out. Oh. Here's the thing though, here. this kind of stage, like Jose is scary on hit. He is so aggressive that I wouldn't be put it past him and just take two stocks straight. You know, he's the kind of player that can do that. No, absolutely, but you know what? DVD wasn't getting these kind of punishes before, and I don't think it's as much nice. a stage as much as DVD's figuring out what he can get away with. Right. And that was a good option to, to, to go to the ledge instead of what he's been doing, which is often F smashes. I mean, the look, oh my god, he's so good on this stage. Dude, I, but uh, you're hundred percent correct, but you know what? I, that would have worked on, you know, Fountain or Battlefield, you know? Like, you know, there's a couple stages where that could have worked. I think DVD is getting a little more confident because of that last game. The last game was close. It, it yeah. was his own bomb that did, did him in. Yeah. Was they putting up a wall? Which isn't something that I would say Ness is known for, but he does it somehow. Yeah, he's been doing it for two straight games. PS2, Woo! PK Fire, PK he Thunder, back airs. Like, he's using all that to wall off his opponent. He's a Riverside Savage, as they say. Who's they? And when was that ever said? I, what, they what is say that, that about uh, him and Sosa. The Seriously, Riverside him, Savage. Blank. And Blank, yeah, I, I said Blank, I know. They're from Riverside, yeah. Never heard of it. <laughs> All I'm right. kidding, please. I don't need Riverside coming at me. Hey. Knocking on my door. <laughs> Hoodlums. I don't want it up. You don't? Nah, it's distracting. You don't have to, but I just Alright man, you could keep it by your side then, alright? Okay. I don't 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 bring the don't bring your tablet into the bedroom. Oh god. We're supposed to be spending quality time together. You know what? What? Go ahead, tell me. Tell me, tell me I'm not good enough. I spent enough time with you. Are you kidding? You got married <laughs> and you forgot about everyone. I am. I've been. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Please. I've been at more tournaments this year than I've ever been in my life. I, right. I'm uh, honestly. Uh, you can't count all the events at Evo as separate tournaments. Two, Evo and one, and Blacklist and this one and LTC. Okay. All right. I'm gonna be honest with you. I would have done a spit take if that hit. <laughs> all right. So we're on Smash though. I've seen. We've seen a couple people take DVD here. Uh, Tech Boy took him here too. He, he, you know what? For a moving platform, he uses it damn well. Yes, he does. He follows it. Uh, an <laughs> SDI shield. Situation. Very, very strange. You know, it looked like the bomb was DIing up also. <laughs> yeah. And uh, DVD's spacing is looking a little bit better. He's uh, not being put into position. Oh, wow. Late ass down air and actually auto cancels. He's not being put into positions where the PK Thunder is threatening him as, a, as much. He's right below it or right outside of it. Actually, right below it is a little bit better. It's the classic thing that Pooch uh, told, oh gosh, I wish I remember who it was right now, but basically, uh, you know, against Ness, one option that's really good against PK Fire is just run up and shield. He has a huge animation of where he just hangs there. 
shooting shot. And the girl is like, nah, I have somebody, man. Don't shoot your shot, please. <laughs> I got a guy back home. You like my Twitter references? IPK, it was IPK, yeah, yeah. That's right, at Paragon. So that got him to run back, I guess, for the last game or whatever it was. And, you know, Jose really, like, making Ness look confident and putting up a wall. Like I said, not really traditionally known as a walling character besides his fair, but he's using back airs and airs. Um, but sort of losing that battle right now, even though it's looking good. It's not really getting him as much as he needs. Oh, yeah, that must be so frustrating for Jose to get hit by that. It's just so difficult to sweet spot, you know, and, and then on top of that, where else are you going to go? There's no mix-up on that. You just have to hit it the sweet spot or else he's just going to get a free swing at you. Right. And these are the, uh, the like, mix-ups between up air and back air that I was talking about and low percentages that uh, Toon Link has. And uh, can you tell that I started playing this character recently? Um, he like, you know, he like gets to mix up which hit he goes for, and the SDI is different for each one. They uh, sort of mix up what you'll hit get hit by. Your DVD is just super quick reactions right now. Oh my, oh my God, goodness! He knows the platform's there. there too. He's there to save him. He's got four stocks to Jose's one, and Jose's in the air, which is oh, hits him with the bat. That was a super bad position for Jose, though. Can DVD force a game 5 in two straight sets after falling 0-2? Are we at Super Saiyan uh, DVD? Do we see a small tail starting to sprout heading toward 4? <laughs> wow. Oh, he waited out the boomerang and the possibility that his, comp his throw will get broken. He wanted to be ready for that. Oh my oh, god, so much the damage! World. The returning boomerang and the upbeat. This is such a good top 8, dude. I can't actually get over it. Oh ah, my goodness, DVD! DVD. Crazy. Don't throw it away, man. Because Jose has shown that he can just take two stops from you. I, it would be the most DVD thing in history, though. Ah, he went for the grab. And, and Jose, so did Jose! Jose. Just I, I, a DVD is grab in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> you know, man, when you have a tether grab and you miss, you just have all the time in the world yeah. to think about what you've done. Yeah. Uh, DVD's grab was in New, uh, was in New Jersey. Jose's was in uh, New York, and we're in Long Island. <laughs> But actually, I gotta say though, DVD's grabs have been, he hasn't been putting out as many questions one, as that have been putting him in bad positions in the last few sets I've commented of him in the top eight. He seems to be in the right mindset. Like that, that DVD last year, who I always said, I was like, this guy can make top eight in any national. And I think um, he had a, a rough patch, but if he takes this set from Jose, who's arguably, last year was a top 10 player, and arguably still, still this year, um, that would be a huge confidence boost for him. Um, Jose's relentless right now, though. He understands it's not a good look to go up 2-0 and then drop it. Doesn't quite sweet spot it. DP overshoots the dash attack. And this Nair wall DI'ing in. Uh-oh. Oh. I have Smash. Yep. He's living, though. He's living. Good stuff. Good DI by Jose. Go for it again. Oh, he does. He pulls it early, and the second hit doesn't get, doesn't get anything. Oh my goodness! Woo! Tried to SDI behind him, but didn't get anywhere. Oh my god, these guys. Both these characters have such good anti combo tools. They combo break so, so well sometimes. Wow, I've got him right out of the town. Yo, if, you, if your friends aren't watching this, please tell them to watch. This is like seriously one of the hypest top eights I've competed in a while. I'm having a blast watching these guys play. Every game is, like, so many of the games have gone to last game. From 2-0. All the way back. Dude, he's battling right now. He's gonna, you know, Jose's just not getting as much out of the grabs as, as he was previously, and then DVD is getting a lot more out of everything than he was. That's just been the biggest difference. The punish games have been completely altered. Yeah, whereas before, oh, he goes for it again. And now, and game, 
goes to the F tilt again. In game one, that was exactly the situation where Jose took like a quick two stock lead against uh, Jose, or against DVD, or at least the first stock. I can't remember which one it was, but. Uh, oh. oh, that would have been absolutely oh. bananas. The down air actually puts him in a worse position, reaching out that hitbox and getting hit by the up air. These guys are going hit for hit. Literally the exact same percentage right now. DVD gets the first opening. And gets a confirmed two with a boomerang coming back to in case the first one doesn't hit. DVD, man, he, his movement has just been improved tenfold. Perfect get-up get attack there to get uh, Jose off him. The Z-drop also looking good. Catches him overextending with the jump. He was trying to cross him up, but... Uh, Eventually, like with Jun Link, he can only do it so long before somebody will read your jump and knock you out, so you have to be ready. Jose ready to needs to figure it out and figure it out quickly. Uh, DVD has basically fallen on top of him and traded Bomb Hit yes. into an up there himself like three times already in the last two games. So I, I, I don't know if Jose just needs to understand, like, trading with the Bomb, he's probably not going to get a move out faster than, than, than DVD is. Yeah, he only did it once, and it was kind of big when he did it, so... It might be like this thing, like, I can do it again. Like, I'm going to make it work. Yeah. But, but it was also at 100 and something percent right. DVD. It led to a kill. But now, since that moment, it's every single time it seems like it's gone in DVD's favor. And Jose's on his tournament stock. That's what DVD's looking He's for. He's corner now, damage. which is terrible position versus Toon Link. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, DVD. Yeah, he makes it out of the corner, but it's still feeling corner like he actually is retreating to the corner trying to figure out a way in and gets it with a PK fire in the air, which is not ne necessarily the best position for Ness to hit you with that. Alright, got him with the nair again. <laughs> this could be it right here. If he gets this combo, oh no, actually that time Jose makes it out. But the bomb worked out for Jose that exact situation. He up aired out of it. Kill DVD. And DVD takes out Jose V. It's a haiku, baby. I don't know if it's a haiku. DVD.